I'm speaking with Mr. Ismaila Zarma. He's with the Energy Commission of Nigeria. Mr. Zarma, Huawei is dedicated to empower the energy companies to realize automation and intelligence. Now, Huawei is already serving 12 of the world's top energy companies with the most completed ICT solutions. What's your impression of Huawei? Okay, uh, as you're aware, I'm from Nigeria, and uh, I'm quite aware of Huawei uh, energy solution in the whole country, in the whole world. It has been in the front of the technology. We are very much impressed with their own services and product for the past years. Uh, in some of their programs, like the issues of uh, integrated security systems, it is a very well development that people like us in the Nigeria where crude oil vandalization or pipeline vandalization is a problem. We would like to use that type of uh, uh, process or the type of solutions being provided by Huawei technology to see to the solution of our pipeline vandalization through the security uh, integrated solutions. So here at the 22nd World Energy Congress, Huawei is showcasing a 4G base station, unified intelligent meeting terminal, efficient solar power inverter, etc depicting how to drive smart energy via innovative ICT. What's your impression of Huawei energy booths? It's the issue of, uh, I'm so impressed with the issue of smart grid. The smart solution Huawei Technologies is providing. Also, I'm so impressed by their, uh, their, their new improved solar power panels that are bringing very high efficiency as compared to some of the product from the Asia region. Mr. Zarma, do you have any opinion or suggestion on the ICT technology development and Huawei cooperation in the future? Yeah, what I'm trying to say is that Huawei should put more research and development into their own agenda to see because the world is moving at a very high speed, technology is moving at a very high speed. So therefore, as you put more interest, more funding into research and development, it will be of immense help to Huawei technology. Also ensuring that some of your product has way into African countries. It is also going to be a very good development for you. Mr. Zarma, thank you for your time today.